Acting means to feign, to simulate, to represent, and to impersonate. In the context of my question, I want to understand how performance can shape storytelling functions in film. Performance before a camera and then do it again and again. I can't. Some people can. Some people do it wonderfully. And you seem to do it better than almost anybody. And so there's got to be great the way in which the actors convey these emotions end up shaping how I feel about the rest of the outcomes in the film. So, how strong does a performance have to be to have that much impact on the story and narrative? The film follows Lloyd Vogel, a journalist from Esquire magazine tasked with writing an article about heroes. His hero to follow is Mr. Rogers. In creating this film, Muriel Heller was drawn to the idea of portraying the power of empathy. Too easily sentimentalized and sometimes satirized for his exploration of feelings and empathy, Mr. Rogers explored both the tools and the considerations that facilitate our ability to negotiate relationships. These traits were most attributed to Tom Hanks' performance during his monologues with Matthew Reese's character Lloyd. About a quarter of the way into the film, Mr. Rogers, played by Tom Hanks, and Lloyd Vogel, played by Matthew Reese, have their first in-person interview. The interview starts with Lloyd holding control, exuding confidence, asking his first question directly and professionally. But tent. Why didn't you let them set it up for you? Well, children need to know that even when adults make plans, sometimes they don't turn out the way we hoped. Mm -hmm. How long have, have you been married, Lloyd? Quickly, Mr. Rogers cuts him off. What seems to start as an interrogation from Lloyd is turned into an endearing conversation through Mr. Rogers' concern for Lloyd's well-being. Mr. Rogers' soft voice, the faint scrunch of his forehead, his tilt of concern, all feel in efforts to make Lloyd feel comfortable. Tom Hanks' character's performance is not established through the outward pause of emotions, but through his small, subtle gestures. The functionality of Tom Hanks' performance especially is in the fact that the story is about growth and redemption. Whether it centres around, around a children's show, the premise is adaptable to adults. Shoni Inelo writes an article saying, Evasions of spectacular emotionality among many in today's generation of stars doesn't evoke emotional detachment or indifference, but rather a tortured mistrust of expressions itself. In ways, how does the lack of performance add to the narrative or the story? In Beautiful Boy, we follow the lives of Nick and his family through active addiction in his early 20s. Both performances by Timothy Chalamet and Steve Carell are tamed, stripped back and consisting of regular conversation. Their expressions and movement become even more important to the scene than the dialogue. This is more prevalent in Nick Timothy Chalamet's characters as he goes home sober for the first time in ages and is tested by triggering situations. When approached in these triggering situations, Timothy Chalamet's character stays calm. However, in moments, you see a shift in his performance. His eyeline shifts, his body stiffens. The conversation becomes halted in awkward silences until these subtle performances erupt into him leaving and there we see an explosion in his performance. The importance of performance and storytelling is also seen in other films like Moonlight. The film is split into three acts, following the character of Chiron as Little, Chiron and Black. Ashton Sanders' portrayal of Chiron's character shows him as a timid, 
and recluse character. His own body caves into itself, holding his head down. His character aims to fall into the background, unlike his elder counterpart, Black. The character of Black is portrayed as strong, masculine, the man that his environment wants him to be. When confronted with people, he challenged the identity he has created for himself. For example, his mother. He then transforms into Chiron. In each film, the functionality of performance has been to inform the story. The emotions in which each character displays informs the rest of the narrative through their delivery and physicality.